why study distant suns and distant worlds? You don't have to be a rocket scientist to wonder where did it all come from, where is it all going, to wonder whether there are other worlds out there that could support life. We want to understand the Earth. We want to understand our home world. But if you really want to understand the Earth, you have to have other examples. So MOST was launched the day before Canada Day in 2003 on board a former Soviet nuclear missile from a Russian military launch base. It is the first space telescope designed to measure very tiny changes in the brightnesses of stars and oscillations of stars. Uh, variations too small to be seen by even the largest and most sensitive instruments on Earth. The original mission was intended to be one year long to observe 10 stars in total. We have been operating now for more than 11 years and uh, last count we I think we're close to 5,000 stars that we've studied. We have made discoveries like a super exotic super Earth is a category of planet that we never even suspected existed. We have been able to use most to look at stars in our galaxy that are like the sun when it was a baby, when it will be a senior citizen, and then finally the sun when it will eventually die. And so we are using most to revise the life story of the star on which we all rely for life, to better understand our own sun and our own home world. And, and that only scratches the surface of the things that most has accomplished, and there's more to come. If we happen to find aliens out there, that would be very cool too.